playing sports. Somebody caught me right in the chin. It was my top tooth bit down on it. I guess in dermatology they call it a venous lake. Blood that boils up and gets trapped. I sometimes feel it when brushing my teeth. There are times when I'm in the mirror and I'm looking and just smiling and, it, and it'll stand out. So it's little things like that. And after a while I decided I would love to have it all. We're talking about all your most annoying body problems. That was Charlie, who is irritated with an abnormality on his lip. He's here along with dermatologist Dr. Ava Shamban and Dr. Orden back in our procedure room. Welcome. Good morning. Hi. How are you? So Dr. Shamban, what's going on on Charlie's lip? Well, Charlie has a classic, v, what we call a venous lake. It's a, a bluish, purplish spot. What they are is they can be incredibly annoying. They're these bluish purple collection of blood vessels that you get typically, like Charlie explained, after biting his lip. And what we do is we use a vascular laser, the, in this case the V-beam, that has a wavelength that will be attracted to the blood vessels so that the whole blood vessel area will seal down. And that's what we're going to do. So pretty common, vascular lesion. You treat it with a vascular laser. laser. And, it, it, and it can occur on the mouth. It can occur on the head and neck region. It can really occur in a lot of areas of the body, most commonly on the lip, though. And Charlie, are you ready? I'm excited. You're going to man up for us? Absolutely. All right, let's no, put our said, goggles on. All right, on. goggles on. You too. Goggles All on. All right, here we go. One, two, three. Pulse. How was that? Great. And temporarily, it explodes the blood in that lip, correct? That's correct. So you get a bruise. So we're going to do it one more time here. A series of pulses. To... And that, that gas that you see chills the skin to protect the skin from the heat of the laser. So after the treatment now, you can take off your glasses, it's going to take approximately four to six weeks to see if a single treatment will be enough or whether Charlie needs a second treatment. Okay. And then one other takeaway that's very important is that sometimes these blue spots can actually be a skin cancer, such as an unusual looking melanoma. And so it's very important to see your healthcare professional to make sure that it is indeed just a vascular growth. Good stuff. Thanks so much, Dr. Shamban. Thank you, Charlie.